class 6 IMO level 2. Mathematics question number 31. Find the sum of all decimal numbers represented by the points P, Q and R on the given number line. From the number line, we can see that point P is equal to 0 0.8, Q is equal to 1.7 and R is equal to 2.4. Sum of these is equal to 4.9. Mathematics question number 32. Which of the following options is incorrect? A. 5 is to 10 and 100 is to 200. 5 by 10 can also be written as 1 by 2 and 100 by 200 can also be written as 1 by 2. So, statement A is correct. Statement B. 2 is to 3 and 10 is to 16. 2 by 3 is the lowest form. 10 by 16 can be reduced to 5 by 8. So, the statement B is incorrect because these two fractions are not equivalent. Mathematics question number 33. The given table shows the data for the number of marbles collected by 5 children. On the basis of the given information, answer the following questions. Find the difference between the number of marbles collected by S and P. The difference between the number of marbles collected by S and P is equal to 9. What is the total number of marbles collected by all 5 children? The total number of marbles collected by all 5 children is equal to 51. Mathematics question number 35. If A and B are integers such that B is a successor of A, then find the value of A minus B. Given B is a successor of A, so B is equal to A plus 1. Then A minus B is equal to A minus A minus 1 which is equal to minus 1. Another method is that given B is the successor of A, let B be X and therefore A is equal to X minus 1. Then A minus B is equal to minus 1. Mathematics question number 36. If x minus 8 is the HCF of 56 and 77, then find the value of x. First, let's find the HCF of these two numbers. If we find, we'll get 7 as the HCF. x minus 8 is the HCF of 56 and 77. So, x minus 8 is equal to 7. From this, x is equal to 15. 15 minus 8 is equal to 7. Mathematics question number 37. How many pairs of intersecting lines are there in the given figure? Line A and B intersect at O. Line B and D intersect at Q. Line A and D intersect at P. Line A and C intersect at B. And line B and C intersect at A. There are 5 pairs of inter intersecting lines in the given figure. Mathematics question number 38. Which of the following set of angles are acute, obtuse, straight, right and reflex angles respectively. We'll first start with option A. Option A first they are saying that acute angle is 28 degree. Yes this is true because acute angles are more than 0 degree but less than 90 degree. Similarly obtuse angle they are saying that it is 100. Yes that is also correct. Obtuse angles are more than 90 degree but less than 180 degree. Right angle they are saying that right angles are 90 degree. Yes, that is true. Right angles are specifically 90 degree. Straight angles are 180 degree. Reflex angles are more than 190 degree but less than 360 degree. So option A satisfies all these rules. So it is the correct option. Mathematics question number 39. Find the sum of place values of encircled digits in the given decimal number. Sum of place values of 5 and 4 is equal to 500 plus 0 0.04 which is equal to 500.04. Mathematics question number 40. Find the area of the given figure not drawn to scale. We can divide the figure into 5 rectangles. Here a area of A1 and A2 are similar and their area is equal to 18 square centimeter. Similarly B1 and B2 ha are having the same area which is also equal to 18 square centimeter. C1 is is having an area of 8 cm square. Area of the total figure is equal to A1 plus A2 plus B1 plus P2 and C1 which is equal to 80 square centimeter. Mathematics question number 41. Jaya scored in max is 30 more than two thirds of her score in English. If her score in English is X then which of the following expression shows her marks in math? Jaya's score in English is equal to X. 
J R score in max is equal to x into 2 by 3 plus 30, which is equal to 2x by 3 plus 30. Mathematics question number 42. The given number is written in the international system of numeration as 55,234,586. Mathematics question number 43. Mishika went to the market with 4,000 rupees. She purchased a top, one toy, and a pair of skates costing 578.75 pesa, 309 rupees, 1862.85 pesa, respectively. How much money is left with her? Amount Mishika spent is equal to 2750.6. Amount left with her is equal to total money she had minus amount she spent, which is equal to 1249.40. Mathematics question number 44. Which of the following pairs of numbers have their LCM as 144? If we see in option A, LCM of 18 and 36 is 36. So we can take the LCM for the numbers as 36. Similarly, for option B, LCM of 16 and 96 is 96. Similarly, for option C, 24 and 48 LCM is 48. The only one left out is D. So let us check it. If we check, we will get the LCM as 144. Mathematics question number 45. Which of the following pairs of fraction add up to the number greater than the whole number 5? In this, if we take LCM and add every single option, it would take us a lot of time. So we are going to do a short method. First, let us convert everything to mixed fraction. If we look into the result, we find option B and C have greater whole numbers. And also, fraction part of B is still greater than C. So, let us add B first to decide whether they add up to 5. Yes, 5, 5 by 12 is, is the answer. So, it is more greater than 5. So, the answer is B. That's it for this video. Make sure to subscribe. Hit that like button. And turn on post notifications so that you guys never miss out on a video that I upload. And I'll see you all next time. Goodbye.